to Mr. Stephen Tan, Chief Operating Officer, Mr. John John San Agustin, Senior Vice President, Ms. Grace Magno, Vice President, Ms. Bernice Bakun, Assistant Vice President, to my mentors, Mr. Fuji Layun and Ms. Architect Royal Pineda, to my family and friends, ladies and gentlemen, a pleasant evening to you all. You know, it is with great pleasure that I warmly welcome everyone tonight to the Dodge of Synthesis, an architectural photography exhibit. Four years ago, when I graduated from architecture school in the University of Santa Tomas, but instead of pursuing architecture, I pursued photography. I was commissioned by the Department of Tourism to be a photographer for the It's More Fun in the Philippines campaign. You know, every week I would be in different places doing exciting activities. For example, this week I could be taking underwater photos in Boracay. The week after, I'd be hiking the Manawi Rice Terraces. And even the week after that, I'd be celebrating the Mascara Festival in Kabolo. I was, out, I was able to travel to the best places, to experience new adventures, and to taste the finest delicacies that the Philippines can offer. And above all, my photographs were featured internationally around the world. Some photos were exhibited in New York, in Las Vegas, Berlin, London, and even Singapore. At age 22, I traveled to Amsterdam, and I went straight to Switzerland to see the Swiss Alps. I was 22 then, and it was an all-expense-paid trip because I won photography contests. These experiences make it very difficult for me to pursue architecture because I feel I was already having fun. I, was, I feel that I was bringing myself somewhere. But yet, despite all these good things, you know, there was a feeling of unfulfillment. There were all these questions lingering that, what if I pursued architecture? What could I be? What am I missing? We have a dozen engineers already in our family, and we have no architect yet. So that's why my family constantly pushes me to take the architectural board exam. In fact, my parents told me, Mark, you first get an architectural license, then we'll give you the license to shoot. And last month, finally, I got both licenses. But more importantly, is the license in architecture. Through the past few years, engaging in architectural photography, I learned that it is my background in architecture that makes me a better photographer. And in the same way that looking at architecture through a photographer's lens, through a photographer's eye, gives me a different and remarkable perspective. So looking back, I realize it's not an option of architecture or photography. I realize it's a combination or a fusion of this both that makes my eye very special. And to represent this fusion, I entitled this exhibit a synthesis, where I joined architecture and photography to create something very special. You know, at, look, at first look, you may see these images and say, you know, they're beautiful art pieces to be hung on walls. Because why not? They're, they're captivating, they're beautiful, they're bold and striking. But these pieces are more than just elegant photographs. The goal and challenge for myself as an architect and a photographer is to first understand the design and the philosophy of the designer, Fuji and Royal, and then make sure that it's reflected and embodied in my photographs. You know, I implore you to take time to look further into each photograph, and you can see the depth and the expanse of our collaboration. For example, this main photograph, you will see the gracefulness of the curved line the intricate play of lights and shadows. You will see the balance of form and substance, the rhythm of symmetry and contrast. In other photographs spread throughout the exhibit, you will feel the outdoors being brought inside. You will see honesty of materials, and sometimes you will see the warmth of a cabin in the expansive forest. And somewhere around, you will see the air of elegance of a century-old Parisian apartment, tastefully imbued with modern sensibilities. So these are the feelings that I wish to convey to my viewers. In the famous words of Roman architect Vitruvius, the cornerstone of good architecture is firmitas, utilitas, et venustas, which means strength, unity, and beauty. So beyond the beauty of these photographs, I encourage you to look for its utility, to look for its strength. <laughs> 
And maybe one step further, may you feel the emotion and the atmosphere of architecture and design. If you do so, then I would really consider myself a successful architectural photographer. Besides each artwork, you can find captions. Let these words guide you, because the goal of this exhibit is to let you, the viewers, experience the design through my photographs. So let the pieces speak to you individually. Four years ago, I was actually commissioned to do a shoot. Uh, it was for a new high-end project, and it was to be entered in an international architectural competition. This was actually my first photography commission for architecture, and that contest won silver. Tonight, I feel that it finally has gone a full circle, because that project was actually a Zimora. And tonight, I'm very blessed and very happy to have, present, to have the chance to present my exhibit in the same venue. So I have dedicated a special portion of this exhibit, the whole rear wing actually, to feature my collaboration with SM. So SM, thank you for supporting me once again. My very first exhibit, Limitless, was right after my graduation. And I find it very funny that now, right after passing the board exam, I'm having another exhibit with them, Synthesis. So special thanks to Ms. Annie Garcia for always believing in my potential and supporting me all the way. To my mentors, Gucci Layo and Royal Pileda. Thank you for showing me how far design can go. It is through your guidance that I am continually learning how to become a better architect and designer. In our collaboration as architectural firm and photographer, I feel there is spontaneity, there is mutual respect between creative minds, and there is learning. For that, I thank you very much. It was only last week Tuesday when we decided that we're really pushing through with this exhibit. So that gave us roughly nine days to plan, to select, and to execute this exhibit. And you know, I never thought this could be possible, but hey, we're all here tonight. So I would like to thank the people who made this event possible. To architect Nicole Tan and to my colleagues from Gucci Royal, thank you. To Mr. Arvin Tan. <laughs> To Mr. Arvin Ang and the head of his marketing team. To Ms. J.M. Aceda and the SM Aura team. To Mr. Anton Pantai and Artist Space. It was because of you that this exhibit is possible. So now I know that I can do an exhibit in nine days. <laughs> to my parents. There. Engineer Ginesto and Rilin Dago. Thank you for giving me the freedom to pursue photography. At the same time, encourage me to do architecture. You know, I feel I can always achieve the greatest success in life with your unwavering support. To Eric Beltran, my photography partner, thank you for constantly challenging our team to be the best in the industry. Special thanks to architect Nicole Tan, because as a colleague, she is driven, she is passionate, and she's intense. But more importantly, she brings these same qualities as a friend. She would do anything to see her friends succeed. So Nicole, thank you for that. To my family and friends, thank you for always being there to support me. And last but not the least, of course, I thank God for showing me His amazing grace and mercy. You know, I only prayed to pass the board exams, but He allowed me to be top one. I only prayed for my photos to be featured, but He gave me this exhibit and all of you tonight to share it with. And in the end, I realized that everything actually worked out better than I could ever imagine, and I can only thank him for that. I ended my first exhibit with this phrase, and tonight I would like to end my speech with the same words that still ring very true. That for him, for without him, I am nothing, but with him, I am limitless. Again, I warmly welcome everyone to Synthesis. Thank you, and have a great evening.